challenging practice. Question one: A rectangular tank is half with water. Another six hundred and fifty cm cube is needed to make it three fifths full. How much water will be in the tank when it is three fifths full? So over here, we are trying to change three fifths into six tenths because it is easier to take half of ten than half of five. So if we have ten units, half of ten units will be five units. So five units will be here, and it is half with water. So what is five fifths? If we change it to a denominator of ten, it will be six tenths. So in order to make it six tenths full, we have to add another an additional six hundred fifty cm cube. So for one unit, for one additional unit, so that we can have it six tenths full, we need an additional six hundred fifty cm cube. So one unit will be six hundred fifty cm cube. Six units will be times six. So the answer is 3,900. Question 2. A cube has a surface area of 216 square centimeters. So we have a cube over here. So a cube has six faces and they are the same. To find the area of one face, we take 216 divided by 6 and that will be 36. After we have the surface area of one face, we have to find the dimension of the edges. So this is the area of a square. It is 36 cm square. So the length, the sides will be, have to be 6 and 6. So one side has to be 6. We know over here that for a second cube, the edges are 3 times as long. So it will be 18 cm long. So now we have a cube and it's 18 by 18. If it is 18 by 18, the area will be 324 cm cube. And we have 6 of these. So therefore, the new surface area will be 1,944. What is the difference? The difference will be 1,944 minus 216, which is 1,728. Problem solving. A prism has a square base whose edges each measure 5 cm. The ratio of its height to its width is 4 is to 1. Find the volume of the rectangular prism. So over here, we have a square base. And the sides are 5 cm by 5 cm. The ratio between the height to the width is 4 is to 1. So if the width is 5 cm, the height will be 20 cm. Let's do the math. So over here, we're trying to find the volume. Volume would be the length times the width times the height. The length is 5, the width is 5, and the height is 20 cm. So this would be... 25 times 20, which should be 500. 